Okay, the sky is a little darker off to the east. And east is the direction in which the solar eclipse, the total solar eclipse, is passing across the United States. So this would be the direction that will get the most darkness. And we'll just pan around here to the sun. And do you see that glow with the ring around it? We're pretty close to the full eclipse, I think. So here again, off to the east, seems much darker than to the west. And the news said that 247 was approximately the peak viewing time. So here we are, peak viewing time, checking it out. And that suddenly is darker in the yard, and it's not overcast, as you'll be able to see here. It's not overcast. Sky's clear, pretty much. But ironically, it seems pretty dark in my yard. What is also interesting are these crescent moon shapes that the light is reflecting from the sun. See those crescent moon shapes? All of them right there, rode right up. That is something I've never seen before here. I'll look at it from different angles so you can see. Let's peek at the sun again. Peeking through the trees. And it's reflecting crescent moons all over my lawn here. 
or lack of lawn, as you can see in spots. See those crescent moon shapes? And they're here. And they're here where the sun is reflecting through. Look at those unique crescent moon shapes. That's got to be, I've never seen anything like this. That's got to be the sun around the moon passing in front of it. What a unique phenomena. It's all over my driveway now. This is how the sun is reflecting. You can see it has nothing to do with the shape of the tree because you can see the tree shadow. But where the light is coming through, it's all like crescent moons. And here in Dade City, Florida, this is what we're getting. For the total eclipse. I'll try and come out here and get another view of the sun. There we go, more crescent moons. And no, the moon is not larger than the sun, so it obviously can't totally blacken out the sun. But if you look at this, you can see the bright halo of the sun, and the darker center is the moon occluding it. And you can see it is a little dark in the sky beyond it. It's not your typical Florida bright sky blue. But I'm totally fascinated by these crescent moon reflections that's given off here by the sun this afternoon. Look at that one, looks like two dolphins jumping. It's just a really groovy pattern. That in all of my oh, six years of being here in Florida, I've never seen anything like this. And like you see where whichever direction I turn in, those are coming from directly above where the eclipse is happening. And it's showing down across my driveway, my lawn, crescent moons. right now because the moon is in front of the sun and the sun's light is only a halo around it. So this is like a reflection of it. Pretty darn magnificent. And no, it's not your total black as sackcloth but it is a sign. Thanks for watching.